Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I have an actual unboxing to do today and uh, whatever is in this box has been trying to escape. Look, they've been trying to get out. So hoping everything is still in there. Uh, this is a box that has come to me from the works here in the UK. Uh, they have a sale on or they had a sale on when I ordered this uh, and there were some really good price products. So I thought, well, it would be rude not to so i just happened to order quite a few bits and pieces that i needed so let's get into it and have a look bear with me while i just get this box open okay so we have some mod podge outdoor exterior gloss so what i wanted to do was give this a try because i do get quite a lot of wreaths and things as you know if you've been watching me a while hello welcome back if you are new hello thank you for stopping by uh, and yeah i thought i would give it a go on some of the out well some of the wreaths that i get um and see if by putting this on they uh, stand up to the elements so watch this space and we will see. So that was the first product I got. I don't think that one was on offer. Uh, let me just grab my invoice. Oh, I've got 10% uh, uh, off my next order over £10. So thank you very much the works. That's really, really kind of you. Okay. And what else did I get? I have some craft buddy items that were all on special offer. So I have some of the craft buddy buddies, crystal art buddies. So let's get these out. So, oh, well, I've got a Hulk one. Look, no wonder my box is torn. He's looking very, very cross. I think he's been trying to get out. <laughs> and I have another one over there. Stuck. Okay. I got myself some punch pockets, uh, 50 heavy duty punch pockets. I use these all the time for my accounts and uh, for keeping track on uh, what packages and things I'm getting. I do like to keep an invoice for everything. Obviously, I've got my accounts to do for this year from the end, from the 6th of April. So here, £2. I thought that was pretty reasonable for a good quality. So yeah, I won't show you those because they're just standard little punch pockets to go in an A4 folder. Then got, I needed, oh, that's a nice rubber band. Stop it, Liz, keeping the packaging rather than the things that come with it. Uh, I've got a nice little a 20 pocket A3 display, display book and this one was £4. I think quite often I pay in the range about £3.50-ish, but they've not had any for a couple of times that I've been in. So I'm wondering if maybe those will, those will go up in price as well because everything seems to be going up at the moment. But I do use these for displaying uh, my 30 by 40 paintings once they're completed and in for my PR packages so that I don't get them muddled up with my other paintings. I keep my PR ones in these as well so I know which company sent me them. So when I'm actually getting them out to do them, I know which company to say this is where I got it from. Okay, so that was another. They were sort of like staple things that I needed. And then these were just special offer and i thought yep i'm gonna have to get these so they're normally i think 4.99 on craft buddy crystal arts website and i got all four of these for 2 pounds 49 each so as the saying goes it would have been rude not to so yeah i just thought they were quite uh, nice little things they'll make nice little presents uh, and also they'll make nice little ornaments sorry if you've got uh, children that are either into Disney princesses or these are all the yeah, Avengers ones. There was a few others as well, but these were the four that I quite liked. So I thought, oh, I'm going to get those. I think I got free postage on this order as well, because did I spend over £20? I think, yeah, it was either £20 or £30. I know this was round about the £10 mark, so it's not a cheap product to get. But as with most um, sealers, they do tend to go quite away. But I did want to try that. So that's the exterior Mod Podge. Uh, let me know, have you tried it? 
uh, particularly in the UK, because our weather goes from brilliant sunshine to rain and thunder. We had yesterday to brilliant sunshine again this morning, and it looks like it's going to rain again this afternoon. So, and we've got flash floods down in uh, Somerset. <laughs> And uh, I hope all the people down there are okay. It looks like they've uh, been flooded out of the houses. So, yeah, May's been a pretty funny month for weather. Okay, so, yeah, I want to try that outside and see how it takes up. Okay. So, let's have a quick look at these. Uh, they're at, I have opened these in the past. I have got a few of them. I'm going to open the Hulk because it just looks so cross. Uh, yeah, he really does look as though he's mm, cross and he wants to get out of this packet. I mean, something was definitely trying to get out of that box, that is for sure. So that's the set of the ones that they have. There's a couple of princesses. There's a Buzz Lightyear. Uh, there's some Star Wars ones there. Uh, the Mandalorian, I think, as well at the bottom. And then your Avengers. Uh, looks like we've got Lila and Stitch there as well. So it's quite a few. And there are quite a few new ones coming out as well. Uh, I think they are launching shortly, so keep an eye on uh, Craft Buddy's website. But yeah, so this one is Hulk. They all come in these nice little packets. So if you are wanting just little presents for people, for little people or big people, uh, then they're great. It says Series 1, so yeah, we're waiting for Series 2. Now it says on these 6 Plus, I'm presuming it's because they're a smaller project to do. Most of the craft buddy canvases and things that you get actually say 8 plus on them. So, yeah, I'm thinking that that 6 plus uh, is uh, because it's a smaller project. But obviously, you'll know your children, whichever age they are. But I think they're brilliant. I think uh, getting children into these is wonderful. And they get to learn their letters and the numbers and things as well while they're doing it. So we'll open this carefully because it looks as though... Our little key code is on the inside. Such so as that expression. Oh, he's so mad. Do you know, if your child comes up to you looking like that, you just laugh, don't you? Or try not to laugh because they are so cross. <laughs> uh, so it's only four colours. We've got DMC codes here. And it tells you the approximate number of crystals that we have here as well. So... Not many crystals, what that's 350, about 550, under 600 crystals just to do one little project. So, yeah, that's quite fine. Uh, you've got your little code there telling you what's in your packet, you've got your little illustration there for how to diamond paint, and then I said just all your others on the back there and all your social media, and your QR code there as well. So yeah, the nice packaging. I do like uh, the professional packaging from Craft Cookie. I think they're really good. So let's have a look at this little chap and see what he looks like. So we have our standard Craft Buddy Crystal Art pen there, diamond painting pen with crystal art in there. Your foil, lovely on the white. I do like that. We've got a three placer on the end and a single placer. And we do look as though we have 20 of the little grip seal bags there. So, yeah, good little tool kit. He's got his little stand there to stand in. And he does have his license on the back as well. Craft Buddy, all the artists and all the artwork and everything they have are licensed artwork. So you're okay, but you won't be allowed to sell these. You wouldn't be able to take them to a craft fair and sell them. Uh, you may find that the organisers of the craft fair wouldn't let you anyway. But no, it just gives you a license for personal use for doing these. So And then he just stands in his little stand, if he'll stand up. Yes, he will. So there he is in his little stand. So you've got a little ornament there. But oh dear, that little face. Only a mother could love that face. <laughs> and he's green as well. They are only a small little character. But they're very cute. So I'll do him, I'll do him from his stand. Uh, so he's about 11-ish centimetres which is about four between well just under four and a half inches and then his widest point let's have a look is about two and three quarter inches which is about seven and a half ish centimeters so they're just a small little size but they're just cute 
so if you are wanting to collect all of them they're not going to take up too much room because they're not huge let's just have a quick measure on the little base plate there that one is eight and a half centimeters across that way which is between three and a quarter and three and a half set inches and it is five and a half centimeters that way which is just under two and a quarter inches so yeah nice little stand <laughs> that little face and then his gems let's so say you do get your dmc cards just four in this one so we have oops we've got the black for his hair the green for his body that's a definite hulk green there We've got the purple for his shorts and the whites of his eyes. <laughs> and they are resin drills as well, the craft buddy ones. They're not the acrylic, they are the resin. So they tend to have just a couple more facets on them uh, and they tend to be just that little bit sparklier. Okay, so that is the Hulk. And we'll just have a quick peek in the others as well and just have a look at the colours that back in there i'm keeping the toolkits together with these because i'm not sure whether i'll be gifting these or whether i will actually keep them not sure yet we'll wait and see okay then we have a bell and again the lovely packaging uh, i think they do ariel is that moana i'm not quite sure uh, and that's jasmine i think from aladdin so i don't know all the star wars characters and uh, all of these as well i think that one captain marvel i think did somebody tell me the lady or it could be the spider type lady i'm not sure anyway <laughs> i won't go into it because uh, yes <laughs> i don't know all the names okay so bell has uh nine different colors and it looks like one of them is a special okay so it's like same tool kit. Oh, she's got a very pink face. So that's how a little bell, and she's got the same similar stand. She's got a rose there. Look in the glass jar. So let's just have a look and see what the crystal is on this one. There is more than one crystal. Oh, no, I'm sure there is only one because there's only one that doesn't have like a DMC number. Let me have a look. So that's our colours. Oh yes. So we've got I uh, yeah oh right so it's the rose in the jar look that is the pink crystal and we only need five and we've got a very big bag wow okay what's D then so D is that colour blue now I'd be inclined really seeing as that sparkly I think I might put those as clear gems so that it looks more like the glass of the dome rather than just the blue may do that yeah but there is a lot of color there look so two-tone brown for her hair a little bit of pink for a face that doesn't look quite as dark as that pink does it it's just how it's printed uh two sorts of blue and a green so is the two sorts of blue on that then d d d G E. All right, so. Ooh. We only need two of that one. E. In fact, there's only one on here. It says we need two, but I can only see one on there. And we've got a packet full. So again, you could use crystals on those. And then the others are all the other part of the stem is all that so we've got a blue stem with green leaves and i think i will put crystals on those so that that all sparkles out and then just do bell in the uh, different color actually you could do her earrings as well in crystals i think because what letter is that that's f so f so her earrings are peach there look and her headband is peach. Yeah, I think I'd be inclined to do those as crystals as well. Because she is a princess, so she needs quite a bit of sparkle. But we'll see when we get to her, see what we do. Okay, let's pop 
put it for that away. So we have Iron Man this time. Oh, do like Robert Downey Jr. Okay, so let's have a look at Iron Man. So he only has four colours as well. And it looks like these are all standard crystals. Okay. So I won't get them out. Um, looks like it's just the four. We've got like the grey, blue, white the goldy yellowy colour and then the bright red and the bright red is 666 and then that's your little iron man there so quite nice for children to do but uh, yeah pretty good I mean there's quite a few adults collect uh, Star Wars things and Avengers things I know my brother always used to get the Marvel comics and he was uh, mad on all those things when he was younger so shame i haven't remembered all the names from when he used to get them <laughs> and then captain america oops so he has six colors and again they're all standard crystals so let's have a look at him say so for two pound 49 two pound 50 i think these are brilliant i mean it's still good at five pound or 4.99 but I just think for a half price, it would definitely have been rude not to. I just had to get them, just uh, get a few more for my collection. I do think most of these will be uh, gifted out there. Um, and I was just thinking, I'm back on cake top as it's because I did that cake for my dad. Um, I think this would look quite good as a cake topper. You would need to probably cover the base with something to make sure that it's food safe, you know, and that you're not getting beads and things onto uh, your cake or anything. You'd probably need to seal it so nothing drops off. You don't want anybody eating the little uh, diamonds, the little gems. But uh, yeah, there's nothing to stop you as long as that's food safe, whatever it's contacting with, to put it as a little cake topper. Or even two or three, you know, if you child likes them a lot i think they're pretty good so these colors look like they're just pretty standard colors as well i'll we'll just have a quick paint so there's no specials in these so we have uh, red white and blue and then we have black brown and beige so yeah they're uh, definitely worth having i think these um, uh, quite taken with them just a little project to do my mind is wandering thinking when am i going to get a chance to do them <laughs> i have a lot on at the moment but we will get them done because i do like them okay so yeah just uh, something a little bit different i do like to show you my sale bargains uh, i'm always on the hunt for a bargain i don't like paying full price for anything these days Mind you, I never did, to be fair, but yeah, I definitely don't like it. But paying at full price now. Okay, so we got the four little... Oh, we'll put the Avengers together, look, and that bell can be on the end. She's in her own little world, and these three guys are ready to fight the world. Yay! Or to save the world, anyway. <laughs> and then I got my Mod Podge and my uh, display book, my little punch pockets as well. Okay, well, as I say, I just thought you'd like to see my little bargains if you've enjoyed looking at these with me. As always, a thumbs up is very much appreciated. Any comments or questions in the comments down below. And if you want to come back and see what I get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner and the all notifications bell that pops up, you'll be notified when any of my videos come up. So you won't miss anything. Yay! Okay, thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.